Well, morning all. Welcome back to Simply Snuff. Um, I've been doing a review of my top three snuffs. As I said in a previous video, I've been doing that many reviews of snuffs. I've sort of ignored my favourites really and uh, not had much chance to get in round and uh, enjoying uh, my old favourites, the ones I started with and uh, my go-to snuffs, the ones that, you know, I've always got a tin of kicking around somewhere. And uh, my number one snuff, uh, some people have said, you know, it might be uh, a Mythos snuff or something, but that's pretty new and I, uh, don't get me wrong, fabulous snuffs, love them. But this is an old time favourite. This is one that's really close to my heart and this is McChrystal's Jip. Uh, yeah, as I say, my number three snuff when, when I reviewed it is Fubar Fido Spicy Treat Mentholated. Love it. That's a, that's a new one for me. And that's uh, that's in at number three. Number two is Matt Crystal's ONG. Fabulous, but this takes a biscuit for me. I think this is uh, probably the strongest one that Matt Crystal's do. However, they do say that Sturco's stronger, but not in, not not in my world. It isn't. No, I, I don't think so. As far as I'm concerned, uh, this Matt Crystal snuff gives it all and gives you a real belt with it as well. So uh, it's a fresh tin. I've just taken it out the wrapper. Let's give it a tap. There she blows. The good old jip. Look at that. Finish grind. Never fails. Lovely and clumpy. Dark brown. Lovely tobacco in there. Oh, look at that. Just waiting for me to dig in. Let's have a sniff. You get tobacco. You get menthol. Maybe there's a bit. No, I don't think there's any eucalyptus in that. Maybe there is. Maybe they're in. Um, but, you, oh, man. It just... It, this stuff is an absolute bloody delight, I'm telling you. I'm sure for seasoned uh, snuff takers, you must have tried this one uh, over the years. You, you'll have come across this. Well, yeah, I've come across it and I stick with it. Every time uh, I, I go into the uh, um, the Black Swan snuff shopping with me, I get myself a few tins of this. Absolutely bloody glorious. Front of nose, up she blows. Don't get too much else, it'll, uh, it'll get you a dicky fit. There you go. Oh, have it. Oh, Gordon Bennett, that's strong, deep, dark, menthol coming through. You know, and it's, again, it's a slow burner. I think there's some snuffs around with bigger menthol hits than this, but this is subtly strong. <laughs> subtly strong, if that makes sense. It doesn't knock the top of your head off every time, but it just sits there and you get this lovely, lovely menthol, oh, just glow, this lovely scent of menthol going on, this lovely burn that just sits in your nose. I mean, honestly, it's absolutely top draw, top bloody draw, as we say in England, top draw. Second one, here we go. Menthol again fine grind but it doesn't it's not a dusty thing there's plenty of moisture in it it's clumping nice you get it you see that I'll, I'll try and show you I've stopped putting shots in corners because uh, to be honest with you half the time I can't get the quality of the shot right so I'm hoping this works you'll see it's pretty dark uh, it's a pretty fine grind yeah it's delightful look at that for clumping that that my friend that is what I like that there Bloody perfect. That's, yeah, 10 out of 10. Talk, you know, we can talk about snuffs all day long, but oh, for me, this is just, this is the daddy. This is the one. Let's have a pinch. Oh, Gordon Bennett. Oh, oh, that is just heavenly. Honestly. If you've never had Jip, if you've never, this is the original Jip snuff prepared and packed by McChrystal's in Leicester Limited, England. McChrystal's.co.uk, look them up, get yourself a tin, give it a go. This is my all-time favourite snuff. That's it, McChrystal's Jip. That's all for now. I'm up on Instagram now, and uh, so if you want to buzz off uh, over there and have a look, I put some silly videos up there that are a bit, I don't know. Anyway, that's all for now. Thanks for watching. Thanks for your subscribes, and uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Chin chin.